Today, we're going to talk about a very special coin that could be worth a fortune. Yes, you heard that right. A fortune, it's the 1965 penny with no mint mark. And it's a coin that has been the talk of the town among coin collectors and enthusiasts. But what makes it so special, and how much is it worth? Well, that's exactly what we're going to find out in this video, so let's get started. Script. First things first. Let's take a closer look at the 1965 penny no mint mark, as you may already know. The mint mark is the small letter or letters that are stamped on a coin to indicate which mint it was produced at. The 1965 penny no mint mark, as the name suggests, does not have any mint mark. But what's interesting is that it was not produced at any of the regular mints instead. It was produced at the Philadelphia Mint, which is known for producing coins without mint marks. Now, you might be wondering why the lack of a mint mark makes this coin so special. Well, my friend, it's simple supply and demand. The 1965 penny no mint mark is a rare coin, and its value lies in its rarity. According to reports, only about 20,000 of these coins were produced, making it a highly sought-after collectible among coin enthusiasts. So, how much is the 1965 penny no mint mark worth? Well, the value of this coin can vary depending on its condition, rarity, and demand. On average, a 1965 penny no mint mark in good condition can fetch anywhere between $500,000 to $550,000. However, there have been reports of some coins selling for much more. In fact, one of these coins sold for a whopping $1.15 million at an auction. But before you start searching your pockets and piggy banks for this coin, there's something you need to know. The 1965 penny no mint mark is a rare coin and it's not easy to find. In fact, it's considered a key date coin, which means it's a rare coin that's highly sought after by collectors. So, how can you tell if you have a 1965 penny no mint mark? Well, the first thing to look for is the lack of a mint mark. If the coin doesn't have a mint mark, it could be a 1965 penny no mint mark. Additionally, you can check the coin's date, which should be 1965, and the condition, which should be good or excellent. Conclusion, and there you have it, folks. The 1965 penny no mint mark is a rare and valuable coin that could be worth a fortune. Whether you're a seasoned coin collector or just starting out, this coin is definitely one to keep an eye out for. Remember, it's all about rarity and demand, and this coin has both. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new today. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more coin-related content. Today, we're going to talk about a very special coin that could make you a fortune. It's the 1665 Jefferson 5 Cent Nickel, and it's considered one of the rarest and most valuable coins in the world. Body, first. Let's talk about the history of the Jefferson 5 Cent Nickel. The coin was designed by John Reich and features a portrait of Thomas Jefferson, the third president of the United States. It was minted from 1851 to 1873 and it was the first five-cent coin to be made with a copper-nickel alloy. Now, let's talk about why the 1665 Jefferson five-cent nickel is so valuable. There are several reasons why this coin is worth a lot of money. First, it's a rare coin, with only a few of them minted. The United States Mint produced only 1,104,000 of these coins in 1865, making it one of the lowest mintage coins in the series. Another reason why this coin is valuable is its condition. The Jefferson 5 cent nickel is known for its high level of detail, and many of them have been well preserved over the years. Coins in good condition, with minimal wear and tear, are highly sought after by collectors. The 1665 Jefferson 5 cent nickel is also valuable because of its historical significance. It was minted during a time when the United States was going through a lot of change including the Civil War and the expansion of the West. Coins from this era are highly prized by collectors because they offer a glimpse into the past. Finally, the 1665 Jefferson 5-cent nickel is valuable because it's a rare coin with a unique design. 
The coin features a portrait of Thomas Jefferson, who is a key figure in American history. The coin's design is also unique because it features a Roman numeral V on the reverse side, which is a rare feature on American coins. Examples of the 1665 Jefferson 5-cent nickel have sold for tens of thousands of dollars at auction in 2023. AMS 60 for Mint State 64 graded coin sold for $285,000 at a heritage auction. Another example, graded MS65 sold for $546,250 at a Stax Bowers auction in 2023. So, how can you find a 1665 Jefferson 5 cent nickel? The best way is to check your change. As these coins can still be found in circulation, you can also check online marketplaces, coin shops, and auction houses if you're lucky enough to find one. Make sure to have it graded and authenticated by a professional to determine its value. Outro. Thanks for watching your channel name. Remember, the 1665 Jefferson 5 cent nickel is a rare and valuable coin that could be worth a fortune. Keep checking your change. And who knows, you might just find a piece of history that could make you rich. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this one. See you in the next video. Today, we're going to talk about a coin that's worth millions of dollars. And it's not a rare or exotic coin. In fact, it's a coin that you might have in your pocket or in your coin collection. It's the 1965 One Dime coin, and it's a coin that's full of mistakes. Body, first, let's talk about the history behind this coin. The 1965 one-dime coin was minted in 1965, and it was supposed to be a normal dime, however. There was a mistake in the minting process that made this coin unique and valuable. The mint accidentally used the wrong die, which resulted in a different design on the coin. The coin was minted with a design that was meant for a different coin, and that's what makes it so valuable. Now, let's talk about the design of the coin. The obverse side of the coin features the profile of Franklin D. Roosevelt, while the reverse side features a design that's similar to the Mercury dime. The coin was meant to have a design that featured a Liberty Bell, but the mint accidentally used a die that had a design of a woman's head. This mistake is what makes the coin so valuable. The value of the 1965 one-dime coin can vary depending on its condition and rarity in 2023. A 1965 one-dime coin in near-mint condition sold for $1.3 million at an auction. The coin's value is determined by its rarity and the demand for it, since it's a mistake coin. There are not many of them in existence, which makes them highly valuable. Tips for collectors If you're a collector looking to add the 1965 one-dime coin to your collection, here are some tips. Check the coin's condition. The condition of the coin is crucial in determining its value. Look for coins that are in good condition, with minimal wear and tear. Check the coin's authenticity. Make sure the coin is authentic and not a replica. You can take the coin to a professional grader or authenticator to verify its authenticity. Research the market. Research the market to determine the coin's value. Look for similar coins that have sold at auctions and use that as a benchmark for your coin's value. Be patient. Finding a 1965 one-dime coin can take time, so be patient and keep looking. You might find one at a garage sale, antique store, or online marketplace. Conclusion. The 1965 one-dime coin is a rare and valuable coin that's full of history and mistakes. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, this coin is definitely worth considering. Remember, the value of a coin is determined by its condition, rarity, and demand. So make sure to do your research before buying or selling. Thanks for watching your channel name. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the section below. Today, we're going to talk about a very special coin that could be worth a lot of money. It's the 1965 Canada One Cent Coin and it's a rare find that could make your coin collection truly unique. Let's dive in and see what makes this coin so valuable. Here it is.
The 1965 Canada One Cent coin, at first glance, it might look like any other penny. But this coin has a few key features that make it stand out. First, let's take a look at the mintage. The mintage of this coin is only 1,055,000, which is much lower than other coins from the same year. That means that there aren't as many of these coins in circulation, making them harder to find and more valuable. Another feature that makes this coin valuable is its design. The 1965 Canada One Cent coin features a unique maple leaf design, which was only used for a short time. This design was created by artist Alex Colville, who is a well-known artist and designer in Canada. The maple leaf is a symbol of Canada, and it's a beautiful and iconic image that's highly sought after by collectors. The condition of this coin is also important, as you can see. This coin is in excellent condition. With minimal wear and tear, the edges are sharp and the details are still very clear. A coin in good condition is always more valuable than one that's been worn down over time, so... How rare is this coin? Well, it's considered to be a rare coin. With only a few hundred known to exist, that's right, only a few hundred. That means that if you have one of these coins... You're part of an exclusive club of coin collectors who own this unique piece of numismatic history. And how much is this coin worth? Well, the value of the 1965 Canada One Cent coin can vary depending on its condition and rarity. On average, a coin in excellent condition could fetch between $100,000 and $200,000. However, some of the rarest and most valuable coins have sold for upwards of $500,000, that's right. $500,000 for a penny, so if you're a coin collector, keep an eye out for this rare coin. It might be worth a lot of money, and it's a great addition to any collection. And if you're not a coin collector, well, maybe it's time to start. You never know what hidden treasures you might find in your pocket change.